Hello, this is a quick tutorial on how to take a screenshot and add it to a live chat support session on our website at pgmusic.com. Currently, I'm using macOS Monterey, and as you can see here, I've got a live chat window open. For demonstration purposes, we'll pretend that the support agent has asked us to send a screenshot of our display option set up in Ban in a Box. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get that up on my screen. So I'm gonna open Ban in a Box, and I've currently got that window open. So the next step that we're gonna to wanna to do is we're gonna to wanna to locate the Shift, Command, and Three button on our keyboard. And we're gonna to wanna to press those down and hold them at the same time. When we release them, you will get a screenshot in the bottom right corner. See down here, and you'll go ahead and click on that. Now, from this window, it's totally fine to just click Done. It'll save it to our desktop. Or, uh, for the purposes of demonstration here, uh, we were requested to just send this Display Options window. So. In order to um, shrink that down so that that's all that's displaying, we'll click this crop button here. And we'll just grab the corners of the screen here and just drag them down until all that's um, selected is this display options screen. Once we're happy with that, we'll go ahead and click crop and then we'll click done. And this will save it to the desktop. You can actually see it right there. So now what we're going to want to do is open up our live chat again. And before we're able to attach the file to the chat, uh, we want to be sure that the support agent has enabled file sharing. As you can see, the paper I clip icon here is grayed out, uh, meaning that it's inactive. So uh, once the support agent has enabled file sharing, you'll see this message. I'm going to go ahead and enable real quick. You see here it says file transfer has been enabled and our paperclip icon is now blue. We can go ahead and click on it. And since we saved uh, our screenshot to the desktop, we're going to go ahead and select that. And it's right here, so I'm going to click on it. Get a little preview of it. So as soon as we're sure that's what we want to send, we'll click upload. You'll get this little message saying file sent. And you can see a preview of the screenshot. At this point, you've successfully shared a screenshot. Now, let's say for instance, you try to send this file and it's too big. You'll get this message here. Uh, if this happens, uh, please let your support agent know and we'll give you further instructions on how to send that via email. And that's it for the tutorial. Uh, if you have any further questions or issues, please uh, reach out to your support agent.